going on guys welcome back to the channel it is monday got another fishing tournament tonight me and dylan have a three hour weeknight derby today it is for some reason the toughest lake for me it's it's hit or miss i've weighed in 12 pounds there a bunch of times and earlier this year had only two fish to weigh in so it's got my number i've also won out there twice i went out there on saturday and scanned quite a bit i i did mark quite a few fish um, but they're suspended right now it's kind of sometimes what they do in the summertime uh, in between feeding on stuff off the bottom and then working to feed on bait that are in the middle of the water column so i marked a lot of fish between like 25 to 35 foot that were suspended on bait so we're going to start on a dock stretch that has been good to us and it's also kicked us in our teeth but we're going to start on the dock stretch and if that's no go it's right near the areas that we're going to get out on those suspended fish too so we're going to kind of put all of our eggs in that basket hopefully we can get five on the docks that's ideal and then go out and cull with some suspended fish if we can get them to bite so this would be an awesome one to win on a local lake so we're gonna we're gonna give it our best shot but we'll see you on the water Probably a three pounder, maybe two and three quarter. Literally two reels in, dude. Small, huh? Interesting. I didn't even move it yet. 
Yo, when you picked up and then I saw you kind of do a double hook set. Black. Call me breakfast. That's breakfast, bro. Right in the empty side. Oh my god, I've been craving walleye lately. Every time I come out here, I'm scrambling and throwing every rod I have in the boat. It's so small. Every rod I have in the boat, because I'm just like, uh. Well, that is not how we had drawn up tonight going. That suspended suspended fish bite was a bust. I don't know if they were bass or if they were carp. That was the weird thing is, you know, there was bait pods with a good mark under them, but there was usually only one mark by them. So I'm kind of leaning towards it being carp. There's a lot of carp in that lake. So um, that was a total bust. The docks even were a total bust where we started. So we, we started on the docks, didn't even get a fish, moved out to the suspenders. And after about an hour, I think, I think we spent too much time trying that. Um, we kind of just went to where the grass was and I caught that one on a spinnerbait quick. And then Dill picked up a couple more, uh, one short on the jig, one keeper on the jig and then drop shot fish. And then we just caught, you know, a walleye and a pike. And you know, I got I got breakfast for tomorrow morning, so I can't I can't complain. It just it just didn't fish how we expected that lake. Like I said in the intro, it it just has my number sometimes. It changes every day when you catch it in a feeding spree. It's it's so fun, but when you don't, it will really really <laughs> hurt your feelings. So. Not how we saw it going, weighed in three fish, not a lot of weight. I, I, we're gonna end up somewhere lower in the pack for tonight's tournament, but you can't, you can't beat fish in Monday night tournaments, still competing and um, you know, doing this every week is just, just a riot. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video anyways. Thank you for watching and we will see you on the next one.